I mean, again, he, he doesn't know who Gabriel is, right? Because he didn't come from an Abrahamic faith. The people of Mecca were pagan. The Quran has mentioned if this book was from other than God, they would have found in it many contradictions. If a book is without contradictions, that has no bearing on whether it comes from God or not. I've had phone books that are inerrant, but I certainly don't think God gave them. <laughs> that we believe without understanding. The brother asked a very important question that most of the scholars say that listening to music, watching movies, and most of the television programs, they're haram. So how can we have fun? Let me tell you, brother, at the outset, that having fun is permitted in Islam as long as the fun is halal fun. <laughs> that the standard narrative has holes. The prophet tells us because Satan or the devil sleeps over our nostrils. Those who oversleep and not pray Fajr on time, Satan urinates in their ears. I really do think Jesus was crucified and that he really was dead and buried. He, he thought that he was a son of God in the sense that he was specially chosen by God. I think Jesus really did think he was going to be the Messiah, the future king of Israel. I mean, that is after all why they crucified him. <laughs> Hello everyone and peace of Christ to all of you. I hope my voice is coming good and clear. Uh, please invite your friends. Soon we are going to start. Uh, we are just waiting for our guest. They are praying to Allah badly and he, they need every inch of Allah to help them. Uh, so let us hope uh, very soon we will start. We are just waiting for them. Um, and then we will start. First, you know, we pray to the Lord that he will open the eyes of the Muslims. To see the truth and the truth will set them free uh, remember we are not here to make fun of muslims they are poor people we are here to expose the cult and the lies of muhammad and uh, for that we pray and uh, we say i mean um, actually i did not sleep good because i was worried i might sleep more than i should and then i miss the time you know uh, <clears throat> you know for me i don't sleep early usually and this is why when I don't sleep early, then I have to, I mean, I have to at least sleep at least six hours, right? Uh, but because uh, uh, we've made a promise for those people, even if it's very early for me, and the, the sun is not out yet, but it's okay, you know? I mean, it's out, but not much out. The sun is out, but uh, still silly sun. Uh, actually, maybe it's out for a while, but because it's very cloudy, maybe, yeah. So we will see, we are waiting. Um, let's see here. <clears throat> Until now we see no sign of any Abdul moving around. Not even one. That's okay. As long as they will come, that's that's the whole what uh, what count. Uh, we have supposedly four ustad, four, and uh, just to let you know, they have no idea they are going to debate Christian Prince. So this is the problem. Let us hope they will not put their tail between their legs and flee as soon as do as soon they hear my voice. You know what I'm saying? They have no idea. They harass the Christians. They chase them. We challenge you to debate. And here we go. We are here. We are here. I will mute myself here for a Hello. Good. Uh, good evening. Good morning. Uh, turn off your camera to save. To save. Uh, if, if your camera is on, turn it off. Okay. Uh, so.
All right. Well, if you, you know, I will, uh, I will mute my microphone here with you. And because I'm live already in my, in my broadcast on YouTube, when they show up, just let me know. All right. All right. I will mute my microphone. Just uh, uh, text me in the chat to tell me, you know, you're already. Do not need, do not need to speak. You know what I mean? I remember what we agreed upon. Right? Let them talk. Don't say anything. Don't let them run. <laughs> All right? Okay, see ya. All right. All right, guys. <clears throat> so, uh, yeah, you will not hear him for now. You know, you will not hear him. I muted him. You do not need to hear him. You will, you will hear when, when, uh, Yes, my friend, I'm here. Yes. Hello. No, don't introduce me. I told you, don't say anything about me yet until they start talking. Don't say anything. Doesn't matter. Don't don't say anything. Just let them talk. They will run. Don't say anything. There's no need to introduce me, my friend. Just wait. You know. Just let it happen. You know. Yeah. Let it let it happen like a thunder from the sky. In uh, no. Don't, don't worry about my books now. Don't worry about my books now. Just focus on the debate. Let them come. Worry. Bring me the customers. I'm hungry. Bring me the guy. You know, let them let them come. <clears throat> all right guys we are waiting for them to uh, to launch the the meeting yeah you will not hear their voice because this is not a live broadcast now this is just a setup for uh, uh, how we will do things you will hear the voice of the debaters as soon as they start talking. Don't worry. Don't worry. Be happy. <laughs> That's good. We don't want them to know. Yeah. Let us start before they run, my friend. If they are there ready, let us start. Well, if they if they find out it's me and then they decide to run, that will bring shame for them because they are chasing those guys for the last two months. We challenge you, etc. They are like, you know, they are all over them. So now if they run away, they will be the joke of everybody. You know what I mean? They can run if they want, no problem. But that will be... Uh, Very bad, very bad for them. Let me put my socks on, it's very cold. I hope they will not call and I'm getting my socks. Hold on. <coughs>
All right, we're back. Look like the Abdul is here already. Very good, very good. All right, guys, we are waiting. You want some want some coffee? Ooh, cold. Those guys are preparing themselves. <clears throat> There's a stars from Saudi Arabia. He will join soon. Come on, get, get me the customers. That's why I don't like those things, you know, but what we can do. <clears throat> Let us see what will happen when they find out. You know, your Zach and Nag voice, they will believe it. <clears throat> the brother and sister, the temperance, he made ambushing. And he did not know that that we are going to debate him. And the sister knew that is the bad ethic. What the heck? Hmm. <coughs> Zach and Mike already here. Do you hear the birds outside? Or my microphone cannot collect the bird sound? All right, we are waiting for them still.
Oh boy. <clears throat> you know what my worry is? That they will not, I hope they will not bring Joe Biden. This is the only one I cannot debate. We show him something from the Quran, he will explain it by saying, you know the thing. I mean, the thing he said about the thing and the thing, you know, you know the thing. And that's it, you know, we are done. We do not need <clears throat> such a genius. <laughs> God is still waiting. That's why I don't want to come until like the start, you know. But I know that you guys, you know, we promise you a certain time and you will be like, okay, where is this guy? He's not show up. Yeah. Well, this is, a, this is not American appointment for sure. You are going to do great. Uh, thank you for the encouragement. I was worried. I'm not sure, really. My cousin Shakespeare said, to be or not to be, that's the question. We will wait for the Islamic thing. Sound fishy. We hope they did not run. Those guys are asking the Abdul, where are you? We are waiting, guys. Sorry. Let us see what would happen. What happened to this Abdul? Oh boy.
And Tinder did not show up. I hope the I hope the potatoes did not run. Did they show up? Oh boy. <laughs> okay, the first Abdul, the, fr the first Abdul, he show up. That's good. The first Abdul, he show up. See, they are using Zoom, but uh, it's giving me double, double voice if I play it. He just told them Christian Prince, you believe it? You believe it? He just told them Christian. What the heck? We told them, don't tell them Christian Prince. In the first uh, minute he started talking, he, he said, he mentioned Christian Prince. I don't know if they heard him. <laughs> This is messed up. Yes, my friend, I hear you. Well, uh, you let 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 your guest. He is the one who's supposed to uh, let them start. Let them tell us what they think about Islam. They are the one who opened the topic, right? Are they there? Are 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 they there? They hear me. Okay, go ahead. We are listening about, about Islam, how good Islam. We are listening. I don't know who is with me. We are listening. Go ahead. Masa al khair, Masa al khair. Go ahead, my friend. You know, I, I heard that you want to tell those Christians. Kayf um, haluk? I'm mumtaz, mumtaz. Tayyib, jiddan, jiddan. Uh, we will see. Yeah. Ahlan ya Ali. Ali, Ali, speak in English. Uh, Ali, Ali, speak in English because your Arabic is very bad. My friend, you don't speak. This is not. This is not Arabic. Speak English. My friend, speak in, speak in English. Your Arabic is broken. Your English is bad. Speak or speak English, please. Speak English, please. أتكلم بكل اللغات عربية سعودية أي شيء وأنت لا تتكلم العربية. Speak to me. Speak speak to me in English. Speak to me in English, please. Speak into speak to me in English, please. My friend, people are waiting. Nobody, nobody speak Arabic and you do not know Arabic yourself. So start in English, please. We are listening. My friend, speak in English. No problem. My friend, you said your name is Ali. Your name is, uh, your name is Ali. Your name is Ali. We got that. Start, please. Start. You wanna you wanna run away? We did not start yet. So you were you were telling those people you wanna debate him for the last two months and now you decide to leave. You are not a sheikh, you are not a sheikh, and you said you wanna debate them. Why you are running away? Why you are why you are running away and don't and don't try to speak in Arabic. You are not an Arab. You do not know Arabic. You, you, maybe you work as a driver in Saudi Arabia. 
Don't don't talk to me in an Arabic nobody can understand. Please speak in English. Go ahead. You said you want to debate about Islam. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead, my friend. Where do you go? Did he leave? this live Facebook and YouTube can understand all what you are saying. Please, Ali Javier, uh, Ustad Ali Javier, you speak in English. Go ahead, Ali. Uh, Where's Ali? Did he run? I think uh, Ali is already He's up left. here. He what? Yeah. He left? Ali is gone. It's your fault. Why you said to him? Ali is running. Why Run away. To him, why you said to him from the beginning? Christian Prince will talk to you. Didn't I say to you yesterday? Don't say anything for the for the at least the first ten minutes. Didn't I say? Don't ever say the word to Christian Prince. Yes, we didn't. But so why you said to him the first second he spoke yes. to you? You said to him, Christian y Prince. Yes, we did then, Brother Christian, but they were suspecting that it was you. My friend, when why we you say that the Christian prince, we made an agreement. Let him talk. Don't say Christian prince. They run away all of them now. I, uh, but they are willing to, I uh, know, to debate with you, uh, Brother well, they Christian. They run away. You just saw him. You know the guy here. You know, he, don't you see he re he's just run? What do you mean you are? They are willing. Where's Where's Brother Bashir? Bashir. Is Bashir in there in the line? Don't go those people. Is Bashir in there in the line? Uh, Brother Derek, is there nothing. any is there any Muslim in the line? No scene, no scene. Oh. So those cowards. What is in my those response? Cowards, my they, message. They were harassing you for the last two months for a debate. And we, yes, we set up the true. time, right? And I told you yes, last time, true. if you ever say to them the word the Christian prince, they will do have poo poo in their pant and they will run away. <laughs> and then what you did, this is your mistake, by the way, because the first thing you said to him, Ali and Bashir, you, run away. I didn't speak, we're very, I don't, I don't speak we're very language, sorry. I heard you saying Christian prince. I don't speak your language, but I heard you saying to him, Christian prince, it is your fault. Yes, uh, we're very sorry about that, Brother Christian. But when we told them that they should speak in English, they were suspecting already, with, even matter. though we didn't tell them. Tell, them. A, tell them we have a lot of people coming from around the world. They want to watch. They want to hear. You know? Why it's only, in, you know, as long as he's speaking English, you speak English. So what the point? What the, what the, what? You do not need to say Christian Prince. You made a mistake. I told you, don't ever say Christian Prince. They will put their tail between their legs and they will run. Anyway, my friend. Uh, now, now. If they, they will never dare to come close to you. Never. And I want you to post this video everywhere. And now you see the, the first part when he spoke to me, the guy, I, uh, uh, my microphone from my, my speaker was mute, so people did not hear it. Later, I will try to find it in, 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 in Zoom. Just send me the, the part where he spoke, and I will play it again so people, they can record it. Yes, uh, Brother Christian Prince, is it okay if if we ask you some questions about Islam? Is it okay to you? No problem. So but, that we may but, so but, that we may learn more about Islam because be, before we start, the before last... you start, make, make make a shout out for the Muslims. Say to you, say to them, shame on you. You promise shame us. Shame on you. You promise us a debate, and all what I say to him, I did not call him names. I did not say anything. I said, don't speak in Arabic. You do not know Arabic. This guy, maybe he worked as a driver in Saudi Arabia, claimed to be Ustad. He speaks two Arabic words, and now he is coming to speak to me in Arabic. But you do not know what he's saying. He was speaking oh. to me actually as a girl, as if I'm a girl, you know? He does not know how to speak Arabic. So this idiot, uh, uh, he, told, he he know two words, like, you know, this, is the, this is the drivers who they do say that in Saudi Arabia. What does this guy do in Saudi Arabia? So it, he's a driver in Saudi Arabia or maintenance or who work in the laundry room, and now he claimed to be Ustad. And what about the three rest? You said there's four. What happened to the other three? Uh, but Derek, what's the three you said that was said? But like, like, uh, Ibn, uh, Ibn Adam, Bashir, yeah. Tamaging, yeah. Uh, and brother, no scene, uh, no scene, all. Nobody is in the line. 
all of them. Yes, what yes. they what they said running, to me running. that whoever that we that will face Islam, they will uh bust it in a debate. But where where are they? Where's they are brother yeah, you know, Bashir the, Tamaging? We made. Well, I told you. You see, I I told I you. I don't know. When you spoke to me, you said, "Brother, we need to prepare." I told you, "Don't worry. I do not need to prepare. That just and talk, and you know, we will be." And here we go. It's because now they knew it's Christian Prince. This guy, he is, did you hear his voice? His voice was shaking. He did not know what to say. Assalamu alaikum, Christian Prince. Habibi. He called me Habibi. Have you ever heard of a guy calling a guy? I mean, he, the guy, he don't even know me, you know? And he's calling me Habibi. He's in love now. They are in love with who? The Christian <laughs> Prince. You know, because he's desperate. He did not know what to say. So they were harassing you all this time. They thought they have a religion and their religion became like a balloon and all the gas came out and the gas smell bad because this is how bad it is. They run with no shame. And we are okay, calling the Muslims. We've... How, how many people are watching now, watching in Zoom? Uh, brother, uh, brother, uh, Ate Edna, how many we are there watching? We have 95 participants in Zoom. Zoom in 95. Zoom 95. Um, YouTube is 409. Okay, no problem. And Facebook is 222. No problem. Well, you know what? Tell the Muslims, tell them Christian Prince, he have a message to your Allah. Your Allah fear him. And he's a prophet. He is shaking in his grave because Sorry, of him. Man. I am the Christian Prince. And he is no God. And their prophet is a false prophet. And now, if you have any questions, if the Muslim, anytime, any Muslim like to join us, he's feel free. Bring him. If any Muslim, he okay, thinks, so yeah, okay, so uh, we are opening this line, our Zoom, for our friend Muslim there listening to our program tonight. Uh, we're inviting you if you want to <clears throat> discuss with Brother Christian Prince, you may enter the Zoom, but. While waiting for them to enter the Zoom, we have so many questions to ask about Islam. Let right. us please give the time for Brother Wendell to ask Brother Christian Prince about Islam. Brother Wendell, you may ask first while I am looking for my files. Brother Wendell? You do not need files. Just give me, hit me a question. Don't worry about the files. Okay. Uh, good. Uh... Uh, good evening, uh, CP. Good evening, uh, my friend. It is our great opportunity that you are with us in our online discussion. Uh, no, we, want some, uh, we want some potatoes. Comparing the Bible you know, you and guys, you the made my Quran potatoes run away. I'm really upset from all of you because you made the potato run away, you know? Next time, do as mm -hmm. I say. Never say Christian Prince. If you got somebody, mm -hmm. please, never, so, ever, ever. Yeah. I saw the message of uh, Ostad's uh, Bashir Sakaging okay. that he promised to enter uh, in our Zoom today because uh, uh, he has many questions uh, for you. No, so uh, for our dear Christians, uh, Why we are Why uh, indeed very happy and privileged that that the famous uh, terror of the Islam debaters is with us tonight. So, uh, Brother uh, CP, yes. uh, my first question, uh, Brother Jando, uh, yes. first we will also uh, acknowledge uh, Pastor Wimpy Tan of Born Again, because long before he was planning to communicate to Christian friends, and he asked for the link, uh, that's why, uh, he is here, so uh, he has many questions also. No problem. So did, did this guy, Ustaz Bashir, did he, is he around? If he is listening, let him join us, you know? Tell him that's not right. Tell him that you made a promise as a man, you know, the man, he don't run away when, when, the, when, the, when, you know, when the challenge happened. They made the challenge. It's not even you who asked them to challenge. It's them who came after you. And now they run away. It's a shame. So tell Mr. Bashir, Ustaz Bashir, Please join us. You all will come. Nobody will insult you. Nothing will happen to you. You will come as a virgin. You will live as a virgin. Promise. So let him join us. Be a man. Otherwise, people will laugh at him. He called himself Ustad Bashir. And then Bashir, he ran away. 
and the other guy he called himself Ustaz Ali, and then Ustaz Ali ran away. And who was left then? What is the proud Muslims? Uh, <clears throat> uh, okay. uh brother brother uh sir Bashir, no, sir Ustad Bashir, I know that he is just only listening to you. He listens to you because he knows what is going on right now. And Brother Derek have communication with him in our on messenger. Uh, Brother Derek, will you please, uh, will you please tell uh, uh, Sir Bashir that to fulfill his promise that according to him he will busted uh, Brother Christian Prince arguments, no? But and he will prove to us right now before he, he will be asked questions he will be cross-examined he promised us that he will prove that islam is the true religion and there is no mistakes in the quran and now uh, they are not in here so maybe uh, we will ask question because the other few uh this past few weeks uh brother christian friends they, when we introduced them to our program to ask questions they were they were always uh endorsing the religion they were telling our viewers and our uh uh our members that please go to islam please convert yourself to islam because the islam is the only true religion in the in the world nothing else more in our program they were uh, ali ustad ali javier is doing that that uh proclaiming that he that we should be converted to islam because the islam is a true religion and now they are not in here, so maybe we can ask you questions about that, sir, uh, brother Christian Prince. If it is true that the Islam is the true religion according to what Ustad Al Ali Javier told us mm. live on air. You see, it's a true religion that there is a God. If you believe in him, he will make your penis endless. This is the true religion. It's a true religion that there is a religion. If you believe in that God, Allah will give you a wife, her ass is one mile. It's a true religion that there is a God. If you kill your neighbor and attack him and take his blonde daughter, he will promise you heaven. It's a true religion that there is a God. He promised me a lot of women for sex. But if I die for him, Allah will make me a green bird. Imagine those uh, Bashir and Ustaz Bashir and Ali and Mujahid and Osama bin Laden. All of them, they will turn to a green chicken in the heaven of Allah. Then Allah, he will put in the front of them a bunch of women for sex. And now he don't have a private part no more. He is, a, he is a rooster. He is a chicken. And now what a chicken will do with those version, you tell me, is going to use his peak? This is why this guy, he is a rooster who claimed to be a sheikh. He ran away as soon as he noticed that he is facing the lions and he is just a chicken. They knew their size. So those people, they speak about true religion when the front, the one in the front of them, he have no idea what Islam is about. But Islam is the most stupid religion ever. When they say to you, Islam has no error, Islam, all of it, it's an error from the beginning to the end. And this is why they decide to run. You see, if their God is a true God, a person who is a believer, he will say, you know what? I will challenge you. I will prove it. And I will tell you why. The Bible says, if God is with me, who could be against me? Can Allah do the same to them? They he cannot, for he is a fake God. So of those Abdul, they have a God, they can say to us, to send themselves, if Allah is with me, who could be against me? Nobody. But because they knew that their God is a shish kebab and their prophet is hummus. And now shish kebab with hummus, that will be a good meal for a Christian prince, so they decide to leave. When somebody says to you, you know, my religion is a true religion, the Quran says, this is the Quran, and the Quran is a stupid book anyway, and the funny is that the Quran keeps saying, bring your proof if you are truthful. So when, 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 Allah, he, when, when Allah he accused the angel uh, to bring the proof of what they said about Adam as an example, he said to them, give me the proof if you are truthful. The God of Islam, he is sharing or telling us that even his angels are a bunch of liars. And this is in chapter 2, verse number 31. Have you ever heard of a, of a God? First of all, he ordered the angels to bow down to Adam. Have you ever heard? The Muslims, they say we are people who believe in the oneness of God and we bow only down to Allah. And then we find that Allah himself is teaching shirk. Shirk, which means 
associating with God, somebody else. All of us, we knew that bowing down is an act of worship, is not an act of respect. So the one who ordered the angels to bow down, it was Allah, not Adam. So Allah himself is a pagan God. In the top of that, Allah accused his angels that they are a bunch of liars. And he said to them, tell me the na those names if you are truthful. Have you ever heard of a God? His, even his angels are not truthful. That is Allah. Because you see, tell me your friends, I will tell you who you are. The friends of Allah, the best close people to Allah is the angels. And they are liars. And who is accusing them to be liars is Allah. And then when the angels, they failed to tell him the names, Allah, he proved by, you know, that they are liars. And this is why he ordered them to bow down to Adam. It's a very stupid religion. Has no base. It's a collection from the Hindu, collection from the Buddhas, collection from the Christianity, from the Judaism. It's a collection from everybody. Even Alexander the Great in Islam is a prophet. And all of us, we knew that he was a bisexual, which means he speak with men, he sleep with men and women. We have a prophet. And the Muslim, they speak about him. And Ali is listening, by the way, he ran away. But this potato is listening right now, but he don't dare to call us back because he knew what will happen. Ali, Bashir, all of you, shame on you. You know what? I'm going to call Allah right now and I will put your name in the door of hell. Huh? So he will grab you right away and as soon you arrive. Remember, I am an Arab. Allah is an Arab. We have connection. We are family. Watch, watch. So look what happened. Muhammad, he promised the Muslims even to be, not only he claimed that Alexander the Great is a, is a prophet, uh, he claimed that in the heaven of Allah, Muslim men, they are going to have sex with Muslim men. So he said, uh, in the heaven there is a market, and this market, there's no sitting and no buying. You can show my, my, my YouTube, by the way, so people, they can see the reference I'm going to show on the screen. Uh, if you can do that, please. And, okay, thank you. And this, okay, market, thank you. and this market have nothing, nothing except images. And those images are images of men and women. And now the Muhammadan, in the best defense for this, they will say this is da'if, but da'if, da'if for them is anything is embarrassment, anything looks stupid, anything is funny, is da'if. This is the hadith in the front of us, and this is the heaven of Allah. I never heard of a prophet, he claimed to be serving the same God of the God of the Christians and the Jews. He promised his men that they will have a market, a bazaar, where the image of in this bazaar are image of men and women. In Arabic here, for the guy Ali who claimed to know Arabic, but as you know, he doesn't know anything in Arabic. Inna fil jannah suqan, ma fiha bay'an wala shira'an, illa suwaru min al nisai wal rijal. Different hadith. This one. Indeed, in paradise, there is a market in which there is no buying nor selling except for images of men and women. So whenever a man desire an image, he enter it. Can you believe that this is a true religion of God? So now the market have images. It's a Playboy magazine. There's nothing there. There's no tomato. There's no zucchini. There's no meat. The whole market is a market of images and those images is images of men and women and then if a abdul like this guy ustaz bashir or ustaz ali they like any image of a man or a woman they jump inside it and they have sex with it so how in the world those people they come to us and they say this is a true religion what kind of religion this religion is even the hippie don't do that So we invite the Muslims, as long as we have still a lot of time, to join us. And I challenge all of you, all the Muslims in the Philippines. There's a guy, his name is Rashid Andesan. The coward, he ran away from me. We called him at home. Still, he ran away from me. You Muslims in the Philippines, you claim that you have God. You claim that you have Ustaz. Same as Muslims in Indonesia. All of you are a bunch of potatoes. You have no God, you have no religion, you have no book, you have no faith. 
and we prove it here. The Quran is not only have a mistake, the Quran, all of it is a mistake from the first page to the last page. And I challenge right now any Muhammadan from your country, from those who call themselves Ustad, to call me and to show me one chapter in the Quran does not have a mistake. Just one. You see, I do not even need to go and select mistakes in the Quran. Just tell me where to go and I will show you that what you choose for me is a big mistake. So my friends, Christians in the Philippines, never be afraid of such a cult to debate, but you need to educate yourself. You need to learn. Those people debate in your ignorance of the topic. This is why they want to debate you about Islam because you know nothing about Islam. And this guy, you told me that he is from Saudi Arabia. I thought this guy is a Saudi. You told me that he is a Staz. So I said, okay, at least you know he have knowledge. And then it turned to be that guy, maybe he's a driver somewhere in Saudi Arabia. He knew he knew how to say Kaifa Halak. That's it. This is what he all what he know. And I keep saying to him, stop speaking Arabic because this is not Arabic. So I am waiting not for a Christian to ask me. I'm waiting for a Muslim to challenge me. Did anyone from your side show up? He said, I'm going to join, my friend. Brother Derek, is, uh, are they in, in the line? Any of them? No, not seen. The four stars became hummus. It's running, run, running away. Yeah, the four stars became chickens. I want you, to, I want you to, from now on, if they come to you, it says to them, shame on you. We waited for you. We set up a time. And you notice, did I insult the guy when he, when he spoke Ali? I did not. I did not say anything to him. I said, please, just to speak in Arabic. He decided to run away because he knew. And he knew, like the second you say Christian Prince, they knew what is going to come. Uh, who is a Muslim from the Philippines? He dare to call us right now. Who is a Muslim from the Philippines? He dare to call us right now to prove to us that Islam can be considered as a religion for a second. Anyone? Okay, uh, our Zoom link was posted in our Facebook and our YouTube live. So if, if there are any Muslims there outside that would like to, to be, to prove that Islam and the Quran have no mistake. The Islam is the true religion. Please come. Please, you are very welcome to come inside our Zoom. Okay. But according to Brother Christian, uh, he's know, waiting do, do for. Do you know this guy? Uh, there is a way to call this guy Rashid. I mean, so his name. Sorry, you called his name what? Uh, yeah, Rashid. You said it starts Rashid. What is his name? Bashir, Bashir. Oh, uh, yes. Uh, Bashir, Bashir. We know said, him actually. He's Bashir. one of our friends here by the Rindel Talipong. But he wants to, he wants to debate in face-to-face. -face. Uh, this face-to-face, hmm. face-to-face is a stupid thing. I live in here. I don't live in the Philippines. And we are here. How come they, uh, how come they don't mind to do debate with you in the internet when it's come to Christian Prince only face-to-face? -face? Because they knew I don't go anywhere. Why I want to go anywhere? Here we go. I'm sitting in my house speaking. So those are cowards. They are making excuse about face to face. Aren't they? They aren't the one harassing you in Zoom. You did not go to them. So Muslims, they are willing to debate with everybody in the internet. Only me, it's face to face. They never saw the face of Allah. They never even saw, saw, the, saw, the, saw the back of their prophet. But only with me, because this is the only excuse so they can escape. If you know anyone, if you... Uh, this guy Bashir who is listening in Zoom, why he don't call? Call him. There's a way to call him right away. Call him. Uh, brother, a... brother Derek, will you please call him? Because he promised us that he will bust other Christian Prince. Sure, he can bust me in two seconds. Like, come on, you know. This is why they are running away. And then for si Bashir, pasok na to. Pasok na si Bashir. Okay, uh, we will wait. Brother Christian, because Brother Bashir, according to him, I will go now inside, okay? Okay. So, Ustaz Bashir, he will come and he will talk to us. That's wonderful. We made him excited. Uh, please, uh, my, please make me a co-host. I, I cannot speak here in Zoom. 
I did. Okay, thank you. Uh, okay now, okay now. So, so I am, I am, I am, I am asking. Uh, I am. Where are you going? Okay, okay, okay. No, no. I am now asking our fellow friends. Uh, wait, because my camera. Okay. Here we go. Oh. Okay, here we go. Here I am. Uh huh. Okay. You know, so we will wait for Brother Bashir to come inside. All right, that's good. On our. The, the, uh, uh, yeah. He's still not here. Yeah, no problem. Let him come. You know, he's, he's still not here, but I saw his message. I saw his message that hmm. he and he replied, I will go. Uh, I will come. I will come. He That's said, wonderful. I will come. He is more than welcome. In welcome. Tagalog, we we na ako. Encourage I will him. come inside. Yeah, that we are encouraging But now, okay. he's still not here. Uh, so we will wait for him. Do you, do you have a link for uh, for YouTube? You said in, you have a podcast in YouTube. So if he show up and his camera is on, we can put him in the screen on our side. Can you send me the link of your YouTube? Don't mind. Okay, Brother Glenn Luzon, can you please send Brother Christian Prince the link of our YouTube? Sure, on our sure. YouTube, Brother, Brother Glenn? Sure, sure. Okay, right. would you please, you. Uh, while we were waiting for we Brother... Invite all Muslims, uh, not only Ustaz sir, Bashir, not sir. only Ustaz Bashir, any Muslim, he is think he is a sheikh to join us, please, because we want people who can prove Islam to be from God. As simple as that. We will speak to you nicely, you know. We are not but, here to insult you. We are here just to debate you. So there's no word. Hindi daw makapasok oh. si ano, Bashir. Puno na ang ano, Zoom. Okay, uh, okay. Pas, uh, Pwede pa. Pwede pa. Ayan, ayan. Okay na, na, kanina si Puno eh. Still have, uh, uh, still have, uh, four. Four. Four vacant seats. Chat ko lang, chat ko lang. Oh, yeah, we have four three vacancies. vacancies. We have four vacancies. Muslims, did you hear it? We have four vacancies. Who want to go to heaven? We have, we four, have vacancies. four vacancies. If you debate the Christian prince, I guarantee you, Allah will increase the number of the versions for you. Four vacancies. Okay, auction. Before we, before it's too, uh, it's sold mm -hmm. out. Who want to join? Four huh? vacancies. Last call. We we'll wait for them. Mm. Uh, okay. Still not entering. Still not entering. Uh, uh, Edna, uh, can you you can be heard here on the live. Okay. Uh, let us wait for them to to enter while waiting. No problem. Uh, is it okay, Brother Christian, while waiting for Brother uh, Sir? Sir, I mean, Sir Bashir to come inside. Uh, no Another problem, question no will be asked. Sure, sure. Go Is ahead. It okay to you? Do you have any question from you or from the, okay, we, from we the will... people watching you? No problem. From the people watching, sir? Yeah, no problem. You can give me any question. You Is it okay? Sure. Okay, I will I will oh, open Jando. Brother John Rico. Yes, Brother Derek? Ano, pa, ano, well, we think. Okay, Christian, please, maghintay na po. Ilalive down ni ano, Bashir muna yung, ano, yung pag-uusap. Ah. Brother Bashir, uh, uh, Brother Christian Prince, according to Sir Bashir, that we will wait a little while because he's preparing also his live. No problem. That he wants sige, sige. also to see all his viewers sige, that sige. he will okay. uh, feature. Okay, okay, okay. Tell him Christian but Prince before says, that, tell him Christian we will Prince let... Sige, sige. No problem. Okay, sige, sige. No problem. Okay, but <laughs> yeah, while waiting for Sir Bashir to come inside, we will let Brother Janrico to ask questions. Brother Janrico, can you ask questions? Oh, yes. Good evening, um, Brother Kirsten Prince, and good evening, uh, Brother Jando. My question is about one of the biggest claims of the Islamic people regarding the miracle of the Quran. They are saying that the um, uh, one of the, their teachers, Yasser Qadi, states that the Quran could not be written by an illiterate man. Therefore, it is a miracle. Um, as one of his proofs, he cited that there you cannot categorize the Quran in either poems, prose, or anything. So the Quran itself is a miracle. How would you respond to those claims? 
Well, first of all, the Quran, Muhammad, he was trying to copy something in Arabic. It's called Saja. Saja is not is not a point. It's an e way easier way of speaking in Arabic, and I can do speak to you in Saja right now. It's be, uh, those who cannot, they don't have the qualification to make point. They make Saja. Saja is like making a rap. So I can say, I saw someone. He is. Uh, I saw a rat, and she was so fat. And when she when she saw me, she stole my hat. This is this is Quran. Quran is a very stupid book. It's not even qualified to be in in the in the stage of uh, literature. And the Arab they used to speak in Saja, and this is Sahih Muslim. And Muhammad he forbid the Arab from speaking in such a way because he was afraid that people will make better Saja than the one he was doing, and his Saja is horrible. This is Sahih Muslim, Hadith number 1681C. So this is, uh, there, there, is a, there is a person, his name is Sutayh, and Muhammad was trying to copy him. This guy Sutayh, you, spoke, you speak to him, you say, how are you doing? He don't answer you by speaking normally, he makes Sajjah, like rap. So he will say to you, I, I, I am so fine. I climbed the tree pine, and there, and you know, like you know, it's just a saja. It's it's not it's not really. So the Quran is a very stupid saja. And the question here, when somebody speak about it, cannot be make an illiterate. How somebody is educated? He claimed that the sun is sitting in a murky water. If we go in the Quran, and we go to chapter eighteen, we will find the Muslims now. They defend that. They say, well, uh, this is uh, in the perspective. Of the Alexander the Great, he is the one who saw it sitting in a, in a, in the ocean. Zakir Naik, he said, brother and sister, when you see the sun, the sun go in the ocean. You think the sun is going in the ocean, and this is what Alexander the Great he saw. But this is not what Alexander the Great he saw. It says in Arabic, he found it sitting in a muddy spring, not the ocean. So it's a spring. It's not muddy, by the way. Translation is wrong. It's a boiling spring. And not only that, he reached the sitting place of the sun. So according to Quran, there is a sitting place of the sun. And not only that, there's the hadith where Muhammad, he confirmed that the sun sit in a boiling water. Here we go. So Muhammad, he said, and this is what the Muslim will not show you, because simply that will get them busted. And this is a hadith, sahih and sahih in chain, as you see. This is Sunan Abi Dawood. Hadith number 4002. And for the Muslims, they will make any any problem with this hadith to, to get rid of it. The hadith says, I was sitting behind the messenger of Allah, who was riding a donkey while the sun was setting. He asked, Do you know where this set? I replied, Allah and his apostle knows best. He said, It's set in a spring of warm water. So when the Muhammadan tried their best to defend their cult, and they claim that the Quran cannot be written by illiterate. I have to agree. The Quran did not is not written by illiterate. It's written by an idiot, because this is the book of idiot, the one who think that the sun is sitting in a spring of water, not an ocean, and this ocean is a boiling water. So how in the world anyone want to say to me that the Quran is a book of miracle? And we can count one million things, but maybe it's better to wait to Bashir, so he can join us, and then we will laugh more. Did I answer you? Is it okay? Yes, brother. Can I ask you another question? Sure. Um, one of the tenets of the Christian faith is that the Bible is the word of God. However, the Quran also claims that uh, they have the uh, they also have the concept of con concept of the Injil, the Torah, and the Psalms. Mm. My question is: Does the Quran or any authoritative references from the Islamic faithful affirm the inspiration of the Bible? Yeah. First of all, when the Muslim, they say uh, that the Quran is the word of God. First of all, we need to ask them, do you even know who is your God? Secondly, the Quran confirm that the Quran is the word of Muhammad, not the word of Allah. And this is, can be found in the chapter of al haqqa as an example. And let us show you in the screen. This is Muhammad, God supposedly, speaking to Muhammad. And then 
He mentioned that twice in the Quran, chapter 69, verse number 40, and chapter 81, verse 19. Both of them, it says that the Quran is nothing but the speech of the messenger. So when they say to us that the Quran is the book of God, that will go against their God words. Because their God confirming that the Quran is the book of Muhammad. Otherwise, I challenge any Muslim to tell me how in the world the Quran says, this is indeed the speech of a messenger. You know, it cannot be a speech of the messenger because the Muslims, as you said, they claim that the Quran word by word is coming from God. Secondly, before we confirm to you the Bible, if we ask ourselves, the Quran says, nobody can bring Quran like this Quran, right? But then we find that the ant is making Quran. Have you ever heard of an ant making Quran? Yes. The ant, she made Quran. The genie made Quran. Shaitan even made Quran. The Quran says all, everybody made Quran. Suleiman made Quran. Mary made Quran. Isa made Quran. Musa made Quran. Everybody made Quran. So what is the Quran of Muhammad? So when the Quran make a challenge, saying nobody can make Quran like this Quran, because obviously the Quran, yesterday actually we have somebody calling us, and he was an Arab, or he claimed to be. He claimed that Allah, when he was, when the ant is speaking in the Quran, Allah was translating the end. So the Quran is not even a book, original book, is a translation. So when the ant she speak, Allah is translating. When the when the when the bird he speak, Allah is translating. When the genie they speak, Allah is translating. When Musa he speak, Allah is translating. Because all of those they speak in different language. So we find out suddenly that the Quran is not even made in Arabic. The Quran we have today is a translation of a, of a previous Quran, which is very stupid. Now we go to what you said to me about the Quran confirming our book. But remember, we do not need such a stupid book to confirm our book. But we use that just to show the Muslims how silly they are. This is a chapter two, verse number 89, or a chapter two, verse number 91 or a chapter 2, verse number 101, or chapter 2, verse 213, and we have, uh, 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 no, uh, just uh, two, 201, uh, 291, and 2989. But this is just a few of many verses in the Quran confirming what we have in our position, and this is in the time of Muhammad, where it says, not only confirm what we have in our position, in Arabic it says, which mean believing in what is with them. So the Quran make it clear that our Bible is a true book. Then we find that the Abdul go in the street and they say our book is not a true. And if they say to us there is different verses saying that the Bible is not a true, I challenge you to find it. They will find a different verse, but it doesn't say really our book is not true. It says, يُحَرِّفُونَ الْكَلُمْ عَنْ مُوَضِعُهُ Is your friend Rashid is where? Rashid? The dog is joining. You hear me? Yes, brother Christian. Is your friend uh, uh, is, is Ustaz uh, Bashir there? I think there's a dog. Huh? Is Ustaz Bashir is there? Uh, did uh, Ustaz Rashid is already here in Zoom? Ustaz Rashid, where, where, where? Bashir or Rashid is name, I forgot. What is, according to Brother Christian, that Ustaz Rashid is in the, on our Zoom? No, 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 I'm not saying, I'm asking you. What, 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 what name? Brother, I know. Uh, Pakimute si ano si brother uh, Derek naririnig. Uh, mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, where brother Christian? Where is ano? What what is his name? No, I am asking you. Our friend, I'm, I, I am asking, asking you. you is, is this Rashid Bashir, already here? Bashir or Bashir? Bashir. Did yeah, he yeah. join? You told me he will join. What happened to him? Why is taking him forever? Oh, according to brother Derek, that he was living in his program, but I don't know why he was. was still wasn't in here he will never according join. to this him we cannot like, enter the this zoom guy is a, this guy is a scared he is terrified you know he just run away you know just face it and i want you from now on 
anytime they call you anytime they try to speak to you they say to this say, say to them you are a coward when we were waiting for you you did not show up and tell them if you want to come to me again let us set up the debate then in such a day and you can invite with you whoever you want as a sheikh anyone anyone and someone speak arabic who don't speak arabic i don't care saudi emirat bahrain doesn't matter bring them those are potatoes they don't have religion muslims don't have religion muslims have collection of religions they mix them together and they do not know where to open the case from because their case doesn't say up and down so the down is up and the up and down actually we can prove it in a second if you ask the muhammadan what is the first chapter muhammad he received they will say to you it says to him Iqra. okay where we can find this chapter they will say to you 96 in the quran so according to islam today the quran is upside down because the chapter 96 is in the end of the Quran. But this is supposedly what Allah gave him in the beginning. So even the Muhammadan themselves, they flip the Quran, they flip the Islam upside down. They try to fix it. And you know, as long as we are mentioning mistakes in the Quran, have you ever heard of a, you know, you told me that Yasir Qadi, he says, the prophet is illiterate, correct? Yes. Okay. So how the first verse Muhammad he received, it says, read in the name of your Lord. Who is the stupid here? If I am God and I am sending a message to a messenger, and this messenger is an idiot. He do not know how to write, how to read. So how I say to him, read. And then, did Muhammad read? No. Muhammad, the angel, he squeezed him. And he keeps saying to him, read. And Muhammad, he says, I cannot read. So after three times, the angel is squeezing Muhammad and no mayonnaise is coming out. Still Muhammad cannot read and still the angel insists saying to him read. So the angel is a stubborn because he is doing the order of Allah. And Allah did not know what to do with Muhammad because still he cannot make him read. Rojanda, andito na si Bashir. Okay, brother Christian Prince, according to brother Derek, hmm. Sir Bashir is already here in the Zoom. All right. So That's we will know. ask Sir Bashir to please... Uh, Unmute, Sir Bashir, and you may speak with Brother Christian Prince. I Sir Bashir, speak. he's already in here. In Derek, Zoom. I don't, what's his name? Bashir. I, 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 I already. Bashir, Bashir Sakaging. I already uh, uh, asked him to unmute. Brother, yeah. uh, Sir Bashir, will you please unmute? Uh, did he? Oh, no. Uh, oh no, he's entering again. No, he's entering again. Uh, still no audio. Okay, we will wait just for a while. Okay, brother Christian, please you may proceed speak. Uh, right. you proceed talking while we wait for uh, Sir Bashir to be ready. I hope he will be ready soon. It's taking too much to put makeup. It says here that read in the name of the Lord, and yet Muhammad, you do not know how to read. So here the question is. When Jesus, he said to the one who cannot walk, walk. When Jesus, he healed the leper, he did not say to him, heal three times and the guy that wasn't healed. So Jesus, he gave an order, one word, and whatever he say is going to happen. Allah, the God of Muhammad, he is ordering Muhammad to read three times. And yet, Muhammad still cannot read. I know. Bro, Jando, patingin yung live ni Bashir. Hindi daw siya makapasok. Uh, brother Derek, nandito na siya. Uh, brother Bashir is already here inside the Zoom, but he have no audio. He's now inside the Zoom. He's using OBS. He's using OBS, but he's not here, uh, but have no audio. I cannot uh, ask him to unmute. While waiting, we will proceed, brother Christian Prince. Tell him Sorry. to say, he need to say inshallah before he start. This is why it's not working. You do not know that? If you don't say inshallah, it's not going to work. And here we ask ourselves, when the angel, he came to Muhammad, did he say inshallah before he squeezed him? No, he did not. That's why it's not working. <laughs> so the angel, he's squeezing Muhammad first time, nothing working. Second time, nothing working. And Muhammad keeps saying to him, I cannot read. So now we ask the Muhammadan, and I hope Mr. Bashir, he can help us when his audio is working. And I don't think it's going to work. 
why the angel keeps saying to him three times read if the guy he already he told him I cannot read is the angel is stupid and if Allah is God and the Quran says if Allah wanted something to happen he say be is going to be here we go he told him read according to Muhammadan and you mentioned to me Yasser Qadi who he said that there is a hole in the narrative and actually there's no hole in the narrative the whole narrative is a hole how come Allah he said three times to Muhammad read still Muhammad cannot read what kind of God is God he cannot do something simple he is not making him even walking or he was blind and he is healing his eyes he is just teaching him how to read I can teach you how to read Arabic in two weeks a lot Muhammad he was 40 years old man and then when he died he was over 60 and all those years Allah failed to teach him Arabic according to Muhammadan so Allah gave an order 20 years ago to Muhammad to read after 20 years still Muhammad cannot read how this is can be an order from God there's any Muhammad want to tell us I hope okay, so. uh, we will uh, still have no audio. His audio still will have no audio, audio not joy. But Bashir is making all the excuses for his audio. His he will have now a flat tire. Just wait. He will claim that the end, the battery is gone. All, everything will not work. Just wait. Brother, brother Derek, will you please tell Sir Bashir to hello, join hello, audio? Hello. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. now okay now okay. Uh, Sir I'm Christian Prince. Yes, Tariri ka bro. Okay, okay, ganito. Uh -huh, okay. Uh, you speak in English, bro. You ano speak in English. You speak in English. Saglit muna, wag mo akong turuan. Wag mo muna akong turuan. Naintindihan mo? Hayaan mo muna akong magsalita. Wag ka munang titira. Eh, kayo naman. My friend, sir. Kayo na pa kayo salita ng salita eh. Speak to me in English. Speak to ganito. me in English. You know English. Para maintindihan nyo. Speak in English, please. Speak in English. Ganito muna. Speak in English, Bashir. Ganito muna, ha? Bashir, speak in English. Ganito muna. Bashir. Ito, ito, ha? Bashir. Bigyan nyo ako ng oras para Bush, magkaroon Bush. kami ng talakayan ng, uh, ng uh, Christian Prince na yan. Speak to me in English, my friend. Speak to me in English. Oh, para na sa ganon, maging maayos po yung talakayan. Okay. Bigyan nyo ako ng limang minuto. Mamaya kakausapin ka si Christian Prince na pinagmamalaki nyo. Let him speak in English. Let me speak in English. Let me speak in English. Ask him to speak. He can ask him a question. No, no, don't translate. Don't translate. Don't translate. But, him, uh, why you don't speak but, English but, to me? He knew that I am not a Filipino. He knew I do not understand Tagalog. So why he is speaking? Yes, not not English? you have to listen first. Okay, huh? what? Christian friends, well, listen first. Okay. Okay, go ahead. You have uh, consumed a lot of time now. Just listen. Okay, start. Just go listen ahead. me okay. before we have a go dialogue. Ahead. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Okay, go ahead. Do you understand? I, sure, I understand. Go ahead. You are the boss now. That's it. We made you the boss. Okay, Go ahead. okay. Okay. Just uh, listen. Just listen. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. You have cons consumed a lot of time. Okay. It's your fault. You did not show Just up. Just listen to me first. We are waiting for you here okay, for two okay. hours. Don't tell me about we consume a lot of time. No what problem. Are you no problem. And now we stop com okay, complaining. Okay. Go start. Tell me what. Uh, tell me how good this time this, is. I'm listening. I will... Go ahead. Okay. Okay, tinan mo ha, kanina pa nagsasalita yan. Sabi ko sa inyo, kontrolin nyo to, programa nyo to. Speak Kung ganyan English. din kabastos yan, English. yung Stop. Christian Prince Price Speak na pinagmamalaki nyo. Speak in English. 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 My friend, let him speak in English. We are waiting. Why you are shouting, complaining for no reason? This guy, he don't want to talk about his God. This God, he want to just complain. If you want to, if you want to complain, go. Wait long. Wait long, bro. Wait long, bro. Wait long, bro. Brother Christian Prince, Sir Bashir is asking you if you allow him to speak within five minutes. 
about Islam bro, if you, if you allow him. him. I will, no, no, talk, no, no, he will no, go. I will wait for me to go. I'm going to mute. I'm going to mute my microphone for five minutes just to speak in English. Stop Saglit mo na. Bago ako magsalita ng English, kakausapin niya kahit Arabic. Pagkatapos nito, mag-uusap muna. May premise muna ako para maintindihan nyo. Patahimikin niyo muna yan. Hindi niyo ako ng oras. Kung hindi niyo ako bibigyan ng oras, tapos niyo ang pag-uusap ng English. You are complaining for the last five minutes. You are complaining for the last five minutes. Kumuha kayo. Kumuha kayo. Kumuha kayo ng ibang tao. Kasi sa pamumuno ni Wendell Talibong, hindi niyo ako kaya. Kaya kumuha kayo ng pusat ng prince para nang sabi mo. Speak English. Kaya ako pagbanggaan niyo sa akin. Haharapin ko yan. Bigyan niyo ako ng isang kalimang hindi ko lang. Okay. Kasi kanina pa nawa na 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 Saglit mo na, saglit mo na, saglit mo na. Hindi, itong sasabihin ko, hindi para kay Christian Prince. Ito ay para sa ating lahat. At mamaya kakausapin ko si Prince Price. Okay, magalala. Yes, brother Wendell. Speak English, Sir Bashir. Will you please speak in English? Marunong ako mag-English. Yes. Mamaya kakausapin mo na bro. Gawin mo na bro. Gawin mo na bro. Prince Price. Wait, wait, wait. Wait. Quiet mo na. Quiet mo na. Let him speak. Bro, you you speak. Sabi niya one on one kami. Pabayaan yon ako muna ngayon. Okay, go ahead. Okay, go ahead, bro. Ang dami niya pero tapos may friends price pa kayo. Anjam pa si si ano Wendell Talimbong. Sige. Ato bigyan mo kayo ng oras. Bigyan mo ako ng oras lang minung tao. Okay. Ito mo na yung premise ko. Ganito. Ganito. Itong uh, pag-uusap ng English, talakayan na English, to, unang-una, una, hindi ito formal. Bakit? Pinipilit nyo kami na pumasok dito. Binagbigyan namin kayo. Nandito kami ngayon, andito ako ngayon, para harapin niyan, nakinuha nyo, na sinasabi nyo, kakampi nyo. Ang totoo nun, mamaya malalaman ko sa kanya dahil mag-uusap kami one-on-one. Ito. Good job to, pa. Sa pangunguna ni Wendy Talibong, kumuha pa kayo nang ano nang ibang tao para harapin ako natatakot ba kayo sa akin why you are allowed him to speak pa kayo why you don't let him speak si, si ano si Chris uh, si, yung Christian ano na yan Prince Christ na yan kinuha nyo pa o ngayon eto bakit nyo kinuha yan bakit, hindi nyo ba ako kaya hindi nyo ba ako kaya nga uh, putulan sa mga sinasabi ko sa katotohanan o ngayon eto kakausapin ko yan Magtatanong ako sa kanya. May mga itatanong ako, lilinawin ko to. Guys, Kung ano yung reliyon niya. To me. Hello. Ha? I, ha? I have no time for this. Ano yung kanyang pananampalataya? No, no? Either, kasi bago tayo makipagtalakay sa isang tao, kinakailangan alam either muna natin kung sino yung harap natin, ba? So ngayon, eto. Mamaya mag-uusap kami. Kakausapin ko siya. May mga tanong ako. Kasi pagpasok ko ngayon, pagtulong-tulungan niyo kaagad ako. 'Di ba? Eh hindi na kayo ano eh, nakita nyo, kumuha pa kayo ng ibang tao para lang kausapin ako. O, oh, diba? Nagpapalata lang kayo na hindi nyo ang kapatid. 
Pati si Ali, kinakausap sa kanina ng Arabic eh, hindi siya makasagot. Tapos sabi niya, driver lang daw, tapos English lang. Kala ko pag gusto niya ng English, tapos eh, Filipinos, ngayon ayaw niya. O diba? O ano? Nandiyan pa ba kayo? Christians? O sige, gusto ko pinagbigyan na lang si Masyar. Pinagbigyan na. Kanyang galit. Kaya nyo kinuha si Christian Prince na itapat sa akin dahil hindi nyo kaya tutulan si Bashir Sakaging. Kaya ngayon, eto na, kakausapin ko yan para nang sa ganun, pagbigyan ko ang inyong mga pangarap. Sige, kakausapin ko yan at may mga tanong ako sa kanya na ito yung pag-uusapan namin. No? Yes. Yeah, yan yung ano, yan yung consuming, uh, sayang yung oras bro. Yan ang Napag, gagawin napagbigyan na natin si Bashir. Yes. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, okay, time na. Uh, ah, okay. Brother Romel Palma, Brother Romel Palma? Yes, brother. Uh, please uh, share audio para makarating kay Christian Prince. Wait lang, wait lang. Yes, please share so, audio. Kasi, ayun, naka-live okay. din tayo rito lahat. Marami nang kikinig sa atin. Okay. Listen, yeah. listen no, you me. can speak now. Christians, oh. Christian, listen to me. If you let this guy one more time okay. speak in Filipinos, you should shut him up, let him go because he's a coward. Okay. Uh, you are wasting my time. Mr. We uh, Christian Prince. We are waiting for a debate. Please don't speak in any language because this is the only language I speak. It's English. This is a warning for you, Mr. Bashir. If you are really serious, you want to debate me, okay, okay. speak in the uh, language I understand. Stop uh, listen go first. Ahead. Go ahead. Okay, okay. Uh, now, uh, you are a Christian prince, right? Uh, I, I, th I think so. Christian prince? Yeah, I'm a Christian prince, not a Hindu huh? prince. Okay, yeah. Go, go, tell me about Islam now. Okay, Forget about okay. me. Why are you talking about me now? What? Go ahead. You, not, you wanted five minutes no, to debate about Islam, right? First. You said okay, you want to talk about first. Islam. Five minutes, go ahead. I have a lot of questions for you. I have a lot of questions. I have a lot of questions, okay? Mm. Listen. You don't want to talk about Islam no more now? Okay. You don't want to talk about Islam no more? Okay. Where's your face? Where's your face? <laughs> show me your face. Show me your face. Show, show me, me your face. face. Okay, hold on. I will show you my face if Allah no, show okay. his... Okay, show me your face. I will show my face if Allah show his ass. No, 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 no. How come Allah? Show your face, How come please. Allah? How come Mom, Allah? He is, Sir Bashir, you are a coward. You are changing the topic. You are trying to run away. You are a muta boy. You are not a man. You are changing the topic to talk about my face. Why are you a gay? Do you want to date me? Are you a homosexual who like to date me? Hello? Nakamute, nakamute. Unmute nyo. Sino nag-mute? Please, do not unmute sa Sir Bashir. Do not unmute. Why We will let him speak. Why you wanna speak in English? Maybe you are the homosexual, Mr. French Price. And look, this is... I have a lot of words to you know? I am... Sir <laughs> Bashir, what is your first question? Oh, Mr. French Price. Abdul, you okay, say Bashir, you about this about this time, you're coward. I have a you listen. You, you listen, you, you coward. You listen, you coward. I you said you want to debate you. about Islam. You are talking Hello? about me now. I am Bashir Sagging. I'm your night. I am leader. now facing you. I'm asking no, you. No, 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 no. I have a question. No, I have a have question. A, no, you don't have a question. Even your you hiding. Said you want to debate about I Islam. I have a question. You are a coward. No, no, no. no. Debate about Islam, I have a question for you. I have a <laughs> lot of questions. Question. I have a question. Oh. Are you a kid? Huh? How old are you? How old are you? How old are you? Okay, are, okay. Are, are You're you out of mind. Are You're you, out of mind. Are you six Mr. Years Prince Price. Are you six years old? Okay, I have a Asia? question for you. You have a question Listen. for you. I have a question. I have a question. I thought you want to talk about Islam. I thought you want five minutes to talk about Islam. Okay. 
Okay, okay. Say okay, huh? uh, this is very clear. Huh? This is very clear. Coward. You said you, you want five minutes to talk you, about no, this. No, no, I'm not coward. You're coward. You're coward. Where's your face? You are a coward. You're Where's your face? Don't hide. I, I cannot show you my face. Don't hide I cannot me. show you my face huh? now. I'm doing muta. I am not I am, coward. I am doing, I face I you. I am doing muta no, right like. now. I, I am doing oh. muta. I cannot open show the me. camera. Show me your face. If coward, you want to have coward, a debate, muta, muta, don't hide. Muta religion, muta listen, religion. listen. When the last time you practiced Mr. Muta, Prince Price, did, did you show your show face your when you do face Muta? Show your face if you want just us hang, to just have hang debate. Him, debate. The coward. He don't, don't hide. He will not debate don't about hide, don't hide. the It's you who is hiding, you coward. I don't It is your God who is hiding, else, and your God is the one who is wearing the burqa. It's just waste of time. Nonsense. Just a mute. Nonsense. Mute him. Mute him. Nonsense. Just a mute him. He's a coward. Mr. Prince he, he Price, will, he, he will not do don't. It. He will talk about my face only. He's a coward. He's a son of Muta. You see those cowards? They were harassing you for two months to debate you about Islam. The second they heard that Christian Prince is here, now they want to debate about my face. Bankrupt. Coward. Your God in the Quran, chapter 42, verse number 51 says, Allah will never speak unless he is wearing a burqa. How come you don't say to Allah, show me your face? And why you want to see my face, you coward son of Muta? What does this have to do with the debate? Coward. Because now you are ashamed. You do not know what to say. You claim to be an ustaz. You claim to be a scholar in Islam. But in fact, you are a person trying to date me. Aha, you... uh -huh. Give him a warning. Uh -huh. Give him a warning. He's, a, he's a crying for you. Yes, we, are, we are going to mute you because no, we, need to start the you. Debate. We, we, we need a debate. Stop complaining. Start the debate, you coward. Go ahead. Stop complaining. You promise a debate. Now, Stop now complaining. you are coming to ask me for my face. What does this have to do with the debate? Because you are a coward. You are trying to find an excuse. So we don't, so we don't start. Listen, listen, listen. So, wala last warning. Last warning. No one muted you, Mr. Bashir. Start the debate. Hang up on him and let him go. We don't want kids. If you don't, if you don't hide, don't hide. You are the one is hiding. Your God is hiding. Someone like you. You are the one is hiding. Okay, show me your face. Show me your face. You're coward. You're coward. You are hiding me. I wanted to show you. You are hiding. Show me. Oh, look at my face. Look at my face. I'm not hiding. You're coward. Oh, I'm not hiding. I did. I did a hundred. You are Christian. Potato. You are. You are a potato. Please, Anate. You are a potato. You are Christian princess. You are Christian princess. Just a mute Listen, him. Just a uh, mute. Remove go host. Remove go host. Just a mute him. Get, let him go. Yeah. Just, go just, host. just let him kid. Let him go. Let him go. Uh, the coward. You see. You see how remove. coward they are. They claim that they can debate us, and now they wanna because they knew this is a Christian prince. They knew I will make them shish kebab. We made them shish kebab before even we start. And then he claimed that we, you know, uh, uh, you took too much time. We are waiting for you. I am here. I am here waiting before even we start. Because I promised to come here to debate those guys. And look at them. The first one run, the second one come, and now he is complaining only he wanna see my face. Why you don't ask Allah to show his face? I am not your God to worship me. Your God in the Quran says he will never speak unless he is from behind a veil. Your God is a female. I challenge you to tell me why Allah wearing a veil. I never heard of a God wearing burqa. That's your God. For me, I'm not hiding myself, you coward. I made a hundred of seminars in the Philippines. I went and made a seminar in Cagayan de Oro, in Manila, in Makati, in everywhere. And Muslims come to my seminars. And you are a coward. And now you are trying to make any excuse so you will not speak to me. Coward. Islam being destroyed without even a fight. So you harass those Christians. You claim that you can debate them. And now you came speaking for 20, 30 minutes, just complaining about, you know, and, and when we mute you because you don't want to start the debate, you complain about muting you. What a potato you are. We want any Muslim who have the courage to join us right now. Not a kid like this guy. This guy, he is he's a person who have a baby in his belly. He is in the delivery room and the, and the baby is not coming out. Why? 
because it's coming out from his anus. Actually, Muhammad, in the, in Muhammad, he promised the Muslims that every Muslim in the heaven of Allah is going to deliver a baby from his anus. And let me show you the reference. Here we go. And Mr. Bashir, I would love you to show, send me a selfie of you giving a baby in the heaven of Allah and you tell me how you can deliver it. This is Muhammad speaking in Sunan Ibn Majah, hadith number 4338, saying, when a believer he wants a child in paradise, he will be conceived and born and grow up in a short while according to his desire. Can you believe it? He will conceive it. He will deliver it. I never heard of such a cult like this. So Mr. Bashir, already he have the baby. He is not waiting for heaven. And the baby is not coming out because now he is making an excuse for staying in the delivery room. Otherwise, if we start a debate about Islam, he will look like a fool. But he is already like a fool. Isn't he? Who is a Muslim who have the courage and the knowledge to call us and debate us? None of them. Have you ever heard of a religion says a man, he will be brightened and he will deliver a baby? Have you? That is Muhammadan. So I'm so happy for you, Mr. Bashir, that one day when you go to heaven, your belly will become so big. And I'm not going to ask you who is the father of the baby who you will deliver. I'm not going to ask you the baby will come out from where. This is embarrassing. But I can feel it right now that you have the same pain of delivering a baby. More than 25 minutes saying nothing but complaining, and he want to see my face. He don't want to debate no more, because this is the excuse. My friends, fellow Filipinos, this is a great example about how coward they are. They harass you, but when they face the one who knows Islam very well, they bow down. Do we have any other Muslim would like to call us and join us? Somebody is brave to talk about Islam. He will not ask me, show me your face, show me your face. This is what the coward Rashid and the San he did.